This is problem number 10 from section 4.3. And this problem it says, if the area of the rectangle is 21x squared minus 53x minus 8 square inches, and its length is 7x plus 1, find its width. Well, we know that we've got a length. We have a width here. We're going to call that w. And then the area of an object is length times width. So if I take and divide out L, so that's area over L, that gives me the width. So we know we need to take an area and divide the length to get the width. Well, they give us the area. It's 21x squared minus 53x minus 8. So we already know the area, which is 21x squared minus 53x minus 8. That's the area. And uh, we know the length is 7x plus 1. So let's bring this over to the left side here. And I'm going to write 21x squared minus 53x minus 8. That's what I'm going to be dividing here. And then I'm going to divide with 7x plus 1. And I know I have to use long division because I have a leading coefficient here. So I'm going to say 7x plus 1. 7x goes into 21x squared. We write that here. 21x squared over 7x. That's going to reduce to 3x. So this is 3x. Multiply it. We get 21x squared plus 3x. We're going to subtract. That's negative 21x squared when we distribute. So we can cross this out. And that's going to give you, that cancels, that gives you negative 56x. Bring down the negative 8. 7x goes into negative 56x. Well, the x's cancel. I use you with negative 56 over 7, which is negative 8. So we have minus 8. Multiply the negative 8 times the 7x. That's negative 56x. Negative 8 times 1 is negative 8. We're going to subtract those. Distribute the negative. We get 56x plus 8. We're going to add this to this and this, and this gives you a remainder of 0. So our area is 21x squared minus 53x minus 8. Our length is 7x plus 1. And our width is uh, 3x minus 8. And that's how you find the width when, giving, when given an area and a length. You just use division.